This is Jack, and he works at the library at NC State. He does shelving, and he also works at the circulation desk from time to time. And he'd like to study in Segovia, Spain for the summer of 2013. This way, he can visit the Roman aqueduct that was built there. Hopefully, he has time to visit the cathedral as well, and he'll definitely improve on his Spanish while there. Now, the program itself costs $3,650, with a weekend option of $600 added on to the cost. There's an application deadline, and the payment is due on March 29th. Thus far, when looking at his funds, Jack realizes that he only has three or thirty dollars, so he still needs three thousand six hundred twenty dollars to save by March 29th. Luckily, well, the situation's not looking good, but luckily Jack is in fact employed. He makes seven twenty-five an hour, working his ten hours a week at the library, which is the maximum a work-study student can make. Uh, he works his parents' farm over the break, so that's not an option for more money. However, he's applied for a $500 scholarship and is eligible for a loan. Now, he would like to go, in addition to learn language, to see some of the beautiful art you can find in Spain and in Europe in general. Now, when will he need to begin saving? And is the scholarship necessary for him to go on the program? Will he have enough money to go on the free weekend with the group? That trip goes from May 30th through June 2nd. Uh, what type of travel will he need to do in order to accomplish that? Will he need to do everything? Um, he has three different time periods. He works in the spring, fall, on the following spring with uh, 54 hours, 160 hours, and 163 hours respectively. While he is on this free trip, if, or the weekend if he gets to go, there are several different options for transportation, a flight, or the train. And while he's there, he can possibly take buses, uh, other transportation, and there's definitely a lot of uh, local sites to see in the form of museums and art. Um, while in town, the local bus is definitely an option. However, the metro seems to be a better option because it's a little more convenient. Uh, while he's there, he will be able to see some of the art from Antonio Gaudí, such as La Sagrada Familia. There are also some free things in town, like the Museo de Colón, and surprisingly enough, there is a giant head called La Cabeza by an American artist called Roy Lichtenstein. Uh, there's more art by Gaudí in the form of Casa Batio, which is, um, as you can see, a, a very interestingly designed building. Now, what we'd like to know is, will Jack be able to save enough money for Spain and possibly the side trip to Barcelona? Take the following into consideration. Please review the video, and we hope to hear your answers soon.